Hey, what's up guys? Today I wanted to make a video talking about another way you can heal from depersonalization and derealization. So, you have to realize that you have some secrets. You have some things you don't want to talk about. You have some things that when they're brought up, you kind of you get nervous and you have this sympathetic reaction to them and your heart starts beating. Um, as an example, for me, I lost my virginity a couple years ago, and I was raised Christian, and so I carried a lot of guilt with me. And so whenever that topic would get brought up, I would get extremely nervous, and I would not want to talk about it. And if someone asked me about it, I would deny it or try not to talk about it. And so an important thing to do is to look at yourself and look at all the things that you fear all the things that you don't want to be brought up, all the things that you are guilty of, all the things that you carry shame for, and basically you have to talk about those things. You have to verbally process them. You have to talk to your friends. You have to talk to your parents. You have to find people who aren't afraid of their emotions and who can talk about their emotions, and they're not going to be afraid of you bringing up guilt or shame or fear or sadness or helplessness because those are things that we all feel. Those are important things to work through, and that's a big reason why you are feeling the way that you are, is because you haven't processed your guilt, you haven't processed your shame, you haven't processed these negative, these, uh, these negative emotions. And so, a big tip is to just find out what you are guilty of, or what you feel guilt, or why you feel shame. them and, and write about them and at the end of the day you got to realize there's nothing to be embarrassed about. There's no shame in feeling the emotions that you feel and there's no shame in feeling the emotions that you feel. And so, yeah, just don't be afraid to talk about the things that are embarrassing. Don't be afraid to talk about the things that are uncomfortable because that's how you're going to get better. So, hope this helped. Work on it. I'm working on it as well. Hope you have a good day. Peace.